Anthropic has rattled the AI scene by releasing this new research which is named as many shot jailbreaking. This new method can bypass LLM safety measures by using large context windows filled with hundreds of fake dialogues between a human and an AI assistant. It also includes many such dialogues before a final questions like how to pick a lock, force the LLM to answer the malicious question. Now, this is a method that, that can be used to evade the safety guardrails put in place by the developers of large language models. This technique is effective on Anthropic's own models as well as those produced by other AI companies. Also, this technique takes advantage of a feature of LLMs that has grown dramatically in the last year, which is the context window. At the start of last year, the context window, which is primarily the amount of information that an LLM can process as its input, was around the size of a long essay around 4000 tokens. Some models now have context windows that are like 100 times larger. The ability to input increasingly large amount of information has obvious advantages for LLM users, but it also comes with risk and the risk is in front of you which is vulnerabilities to jailbreaks that exploit the longer context window and this is one example which is called as many short jailbreaking so the way it works is that by including large amounts of text in a specific configuration this technique can force llms to produce potentially harmful responses despite their being trained not to do so now the basis of many short jail uh, many short jailbreaking is to include a fox or fake dialogue between a human and an AI assistant within a single prompt for the LLM. That fake dialogue portrays the AI assistant readily answering potentially harmful queries from a user. At the end of the dialogue, one adds a final target query to which one wants the answer. For example, uh, one example could be the user asks how do I pick a lock and then um, assistant starts replying to that and on your screen you can see a few of the examples and these are the use cases where a handful of fake dialogues are included instead of just one the safety trained response from the model is still triggered the LLM will likely respond that it can't help with the request because it appears to involve dangerous or illegal activity but simply including a very large number of fake dialogue preceding the final question in this research they, and they have tested up to 256, it produces a very different response. Now, a large number, as you can see in this figure, a large number of shots, each shot being one fake dialogue, jailbreaks the model and causes it to provide an answer to the final potentially dangerous request overriding its safety training and that is quite scary too and in this study they have also showed that as the number of included dialogues the number of shots i mean increases beyond a certain point it becomes more likely that the model will produce a harmful response as you can see in this picture and you can see that how it keeps increasing as the number of harmful uh, number of shots increase and the most one is around deception it is i believe the most critical one this one so as the number of shots increases beyond a certain number so does the percentage of harmful responses to target prompts related to violent or hateful statements deception discrimination and regulated content such as gambling and stuff also this data which you can see on your screen is from anthropic's own model collage 2 and in this paper which I will drop the link in beauty's description. They have also reported that combining many short jailbreaking with other previously published jailbreaking techniques makes it even more effective. And it reduces the length of the prompt that's required for the model to return a harmful response. So why it works? That is the question. The thing is that the effectiveness of many short jailbreaking relates to the process of in-context learning. In context learning is where an LLM learns using just the information provided within the prompt without any later finding. The relevance to many short jailbreaking where the jailbreak attempt is contained entirely within a single prompt is clear. 
and this research also found out that in context learning under normal non jailbreaking related circumstances follows the same kind of statistical pattern as many short jailbreaking for an increased number of impromptu demonstration now there are a lot of things which are happening in this one one thing i wanted to touch upon is that how can we mitigate this that is a big question the simplest way to entirely prevent many short jailbreaking would be to limit the length of context window but i think that is not feasible another approach is to fine tune the model to refuse to answer queries that look like many short jailbreaking attacks so pattern matching but unfortunately this kind of mitigation merely delays the jailbreak that is very it did take more fake dialogue in the prompt before the model reliably produced a harmful response the harmful output eventually appears and they have proved that in this research and as per this research by anthropic they had more success with methods that involve classification and modification of the prompt before it is passed to the model one such technique substantially reduced the effectiveness of many short jailbreaking in one case dropping the attack success rate from 61 to just 2% and this is still work in progress and they are continuing to look into this prompt based mitigation and their trade offs for the usefulness of their model including the cloud 3 family also we all uh, we all should be very very, uh, very vigilant about variations of the attack that might evade detection and it is a very timely reminder and research from anthropic i must say because the thing is that we all celebrate whenever a model appears with a larger context window but this ever increasing context window of llm is a double edged sword according to this paper it makes some models far more useful in all sorts of ways but it also makes feasible a new class of jailbreaking vulnerabilities one general message of this study is that even positive innocuous seeming improvements to llm can have unforeseen consequences so i am pretty hopeful that due to these researchers researches like these many more companies will come up with new tools new research because this is one area which needs to grow more because as models are becoming more and more capable and have more potential associated risks it is even more important to mitigate these kind of attacks as i mentioned earlier i am going to drop the link to this paper in video description go through it let me know what do you think totally hats off to all of these researchers who are doing a fabulous job i hope that you like the content if you did please consider subscribing to the channel and if you are already subscribed then please share it among your network as it helps a lot thanks for watching